there's a very important choice that you need to make with your relationship. Is this a time for you to walk away or to hang in there? This is a time not to look at what happened in the past, but more of like what your heart is telling you. This is an emotional energy that you're feeling. You're releasing a lot. You're thinking a lot. And you're also thinking a lot about the past. Thinking about the past is only going to bring up a lot of bad memories and it's going to put pressure on yourself on this relationship. This is a time not to look at what happened with the previous relationship, but more like what your heart is telling you. Because when you look at the love that you feel, the emotional energy that you have towards this person, you'll know that this person is worth waiting for. Maybe this person is not getting back to you or this person has been busy. This person hasn't been themselves lately. This is a time for you to just follow what your heart says and just let them come towards you. Let them show you. Let them shower you with the love because you deserve it. There's a personal transformation happening right now inside of you. And as you can feel something is happening, you're also feeling differently about this. You're also feeling differently about that person. You know what? Sometimes when you're feeling very hurt inside about a situation, you can actually put it up vibes. You can actually throw off vibes that you don't feel good about this relationship and nothing good is going to happen in this relationship. This is a time for your transformation to run, to run its course and listen to the messages that you're getting. There's a message. There's an important message that you're hearing. If you don't listen to that message, that message just keeps going back and forth and you wonder, why am I in this relationship? Is this relationship somebody that... Um, this is someone that I, I'm supposed to be with. Is this my person? Well, only you will tell the truth. Only you will know the truth. Only you can feel the truth because the messages have been coming to you for some time now. You have to trust what the process is. Trusting with what your heart is saying. Trusting what you've been feeling all along. Is this person someone that I can see myself in the future? Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. But if it is... You know that you have to be patient and you know what, listening to what your heart says can be like a challenge. It can be a very difficult time, but like we said from the beginning, it's a choice that you have to make. Don't make this choice because someone told you to. Is somebody telling you, maybe you have a group of friends that, you know, don't feel if this person is the person that you're supposed to be with or their views of this person just does not work with you. Don't look at that specific, you know, um way of thinking that mentality because it's only creating you to feel more and more hurt inside emotionally you may be going through a lot emotionally you've been going through a lot but whatever the case is it's not about you it's about what what you feel in your heart for this person many times we can feel love for ourselves we can feel love for that person but we're not really feeling love we're just going along with the flow because we can be codependent um so Try your best not to analyze the situation, but more of like look at what you've been feeling for so long. Um, there's a lot of important messages here. Take what resonates with you and leave what doesn't. Um, I know that a lot of a lot of a lot of important things came up that may have triggered some things inside of you. So maybe if you come back and rewatch this video, sometimes it can be more of like um, clarity given. So I like to watch my reading videos twice, maybe sometimes three times, because I can get a different message each time I watch my my videos, my even my own videos. Um, so if you like to get your own um, personalized reading to understand your situation better, I do offer phone chat and email readings and the links are down below in the description area. Also, I do have several blogs that you can check out um, that talk about soulmates, twin flames and all divine counterparts. Okay, so until next time, God be with you all. Namaste.